dumb vibes is here to entertain you. DJ T. Rice, an exceptional DJ in South Africa, a top producer and musician who knows how to give us hits back to back. Of recent, he has been trending for all the wrong and right reasons together. Of course, there are some pictures with him and one of the Quabet Swings that were trending all over social media yesterday, whereby he was like congratulations to her because she has finally gotten married. Little people actually believe that this was a trend and the mass of people believe that, of course, they actually got married. But there are several mixed reactions as Jetira posts pictures of what looks like one of the Kwabe twins actually got married. So do well to watch this video right up to the end so you get the entire juice and vibe because I'm here to give you all the exactitude of the versions of what actually happened yesterday that the pictures were trending on social media. So do well to watch this video to the end. Before I do so, you're welcome to this channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell. Following their controversial exit from Idols, DJ t discovered the Kwabe Twins and signed them to his record label Afrotainment. It's only been a few years but their discography is already so impressive. They released their hit single Hamba in 2020 which continues to dominate the radio waves. It's no secret that the Jetira has helped to popularize the Gcom genre and of course shed light on the underground artists looking for their big break. Yes, the Jetira has posted these pictures and he revealed to us that they have actually gotten married. But to who? Several people alleged that they had gotten married to themselves. A couple of other people said they got married to DJ Tira, while some other people say that they got married to Ausla, who happens to be Big Zulu's artist. Finally, what is the real truth behind all of the pictures floating on social media? The Kwabe twins broke silence and they revealed that, firstly, they haven't gotten married to themselves. They said they love themselves so much but not to the extent of actually getting married to one another. It is perfectly true that sometimes they do kiss and they go some intimate at some level but guys, it's not that far. They love themselves just as sisters. Then, DJ Tira as well posted and said, congratulations to the Kwabe twins because of course, they, they, they just got married. But still, that actually debunked the fact that he is the one who is the husband to the Kwabe twins. What actually shocked us is when Big Zulu went to his Facebook page and then he actually dropped a very monumental quote, which reads, and I quote, Yeah, you, you just took Zola serious and fell. Oh my God, I really don't know how this is. This was so urgent, you all didn't even tell me about this. But anyways, congratulations. And that was when he posted a picture of the Kwabe twins and of course his artist Zola. Simply because of this gesture, many people believe that it is either he got married, uh, Zola got married to the Kwabe twins, one of the Kwabe twins, or it is just a music video. And given again to the fact that the Kwabe twins were seen with Zola, DJ Tira and Big Zulu of recent after they dropped a very monumental audio whereby they collaborated together, everybody just believed that this is the video making of the song. But whatever be the case, I'm very much excited for them because their success has been so mind-blowing. DJ Tira's success has been so mind-blowing as well. And of course, we get to know and discover new artists by the day in South Africa. South Africa is making the trends and the Kwabe Twins have brought in this Afro-pop genre in the South African entertainment milieu. And because of this again, they are highly recognized with their large number of discography. You will tell me what you think about all what is happening as far as trends are concerned in South Africa. 